Welcome to Work Smarter TV. I am Martin, and in this video, I will show you how to format your X and Y axis labels. Well, the axis labels is, are these the country names here or the population uh, numbers on the Y axis. First, we select the graph, we select the uh, axis data. If you do that, you can see there's a uh, box around it, and we double click it. Alternatively, we can also Use the right mouse button and go to Format Access. Um, the first thing you'll notice about this graph is that the country names are uh, skewed. They're under an, under an angle. If we go to Alignment, we can change that. We can say, well, I want to have it vertical, like this. But we still have to change something as well, because if you look properly, now that they're all neatly under their respective columns, can see some data is missing. You can change that by making the graph a bit bigger. We select the, uh, the whole chart, we move the mouse pointer to the corner and wait for this uh, double arrow to appear. Le click the left mouse button and we drag it. And now you can see now all the country names are there. All right, now we go to the Y axis, we double click it you can say, well, you can change all the values. You can reverse the values, but it gives a very strange thing. We can even add a logarithmic scale, but not in this case, because it's the, we, you can say, okay, add display units, thousands. So you can just get, get off a few zeros, which is actually, in this neatly displays millions, this is actually very valuable for this graph, because it makes it much easier to to understand. Well, we can format the number here, we can say currency, which is a very handy option, but it's not in at this point. We can say percentage, but it's not a percentage either. Um, all kinds of fill options. But we don't want that. Line colors, line styles, etc. Yeah, I'm gonna let you play with these. Um, but here also we have the alignment we can say nah I want them I want these to be skewed a bit oh and now I can also say I want it to have be 20 degrees and there we are um now let's move the legend up a bit we just click it once and we sorry click it once wait for this uh marker to appear and we drag it up now we have a neat looking chart all right, I hope you found this video helpful. Um, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the button, the subscribe button below this video. And you can also check out my other stuff at my website, worksmarter.tv, by clicking the link in the description below the video. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.